Hey cuties, <laughs> we're gonna be making a traffic cone today. And uh, we're only gonna be using Blender for this, uh, no other software. So in a new Blender viewport, uh, delete everything except for the cube, scale it down, and bevel those vertical edges just a few times. Now this was actually a little bit too tall for me, so I decided to grab the top face and crop it down a tiny bit. Alright, now time for the top piece. Now in a top 2D view, create a sketch on a plane parallel to your view. Now add a center diameter circle with a diameter of 1 inch, and extrude it upward with a taper of negative 10 degrees. Add a cylinder and align it inside the original cylinder, then use a negate union to join them together, and now we have a hole through our cone. Now we can unhide the bottom piece and join the two parts together. That's a great looking traffic cone. Oh, we're gonna have to give it some color, so just select the brush icon at the top of the screen and select an orange color, then fill the entire object in. Now to get a clean render, uh, open a new image and select your traffic cone. Then bam! Blender just generates the render for you. So many people waste their effort with like, oh, render time and compositing. It's like, just generate the render, it's not that hard. I hope you guys enjoyed, and remember, anything is possible with Blender.